टुडे टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन क्रिस्टालजी ऑफ ट्रेकिया ट्रेकिया इज या फाइब्रो एलास्टिक कार्टिलेज ट्यूब फाइब्रो एलास्टिक कार्टिलेज ट्यूब इट एक्सटेंड लोअर बॉर्डर ऑफ टिकाइड कार्टिलेज दैट इज सी सिक्स टू इट्स लेवल ऑफ फाइबरकेशन टी फोर सो फाइब्रो एलास्टिक कार्टिलेज ट्यूब extent lower border of cricoid cartilage to its level of fibrication trachea consists of four layer first layer is mucosa second layer sub mucosa third layer cartilage the smooth membrane layer fourth one is adven tissue so first layer mucosa second one is sub mucosa third one is cartilage or smooth smooth membrane layer fourth one is adven tissue that first layer of mucosa the lumen of that trachea is lined by mucous membrane that consists of a lining epithelium okay that, that consists of lining epithelium pseudo stratified ciliated columnar epithelium so this one is the pseudo stratified pseudo stratified ciliated uh, columnar epithelium then here we can find out some corplet cell it containing numerous corplet cells corplet cells also is presented and basal cell also presented so here lumen of trachea lined by mucous membrane it have pseudo stratified ciliated columnar epithelium it having corplet cell as well as basal cell uh, that lying next to uh, the basement membrane second one is sub mucosa it consists of numerous elastic fibers these are the things elastic fibers then serous and mucous gland is presented both are sub mucosa okay so uh, serous gland and mucous serous gland and mucous gland is presented both uh, both are presented in sub mucosa a uh, serous gland keep what is the role serous gland keep a uh, epithelium in moisture serous gland keep a uh, epithelium in moist then mucous gland that mucous gland covering that mucus okay what is the main role covering that mucus uh, not allowing dust particles that mucus is continuously move towards that larynx larynx by the ciliary action that sub mucosa containing blood vessels and ducts so sub mucosa layer second layer it containing uh, blood vessels and ducts third layer cartilage or smooth muscle layer third layer cartilage and smooth muscle layer the skeletal basic of trachea third layer okay the skeletal basics of the trachea is made up of uh, 60 to 16 to 22 tracheal ring or cartilage uh, these are c shaped ring made up of hyaline cartilage uh, the open end of that c is directly posterior open end directly to that posterior one uh, this is the anterior part sometimes the cartilage uh, may fused with each other to form y shaped y shaped ends so sometimes cartilage may fused with each other to form y shaped end the gaps between cartilage present on 
posterior aspect are filled smooth muscles and fibrous tissue the connective tissue of that smooth muscle present on that posterior side of that tracheal ring compress of esophagus compression of that esophagus so this one this one is the territorial matrix this one is the inter tertial matrix inter territorial matrix this one is the hyaline cartilage this is chondrocytes this one is the chondrocytes chondrocytes territorial matrix now coming to peri this one pericondrium pericondrium has in outer this pericondrium has in outer fibrous and the inner chondrogenic layer two layer is presented so what are the things inter territorial matrix then group of chondrocytes is presented then territorial matrix then peri perichondrium has outer fibrous and inner chondrogenic layer the chondrocytes they appear in isogenous group of chondrocytes by darkly stained peritoneal matrix then whole whole all the whole this one is uh, hyaline hyaline cartilage chondrocytes here chondrocytes is presented these are the things chondrocytes darkly stained peritoneal matrix then fourth layer adventitia here it consists of collagen fibrous connective tissue blood vessels and now she is presented so last one is consists of collagen fiber connective tissue blood vessels and nerves so this is all about neurology sorry histology of trachea histology of trachea thanks for watching